Yeah, guys, how you all doing? NJT Reviews, bringing the best in model kit reviews. Also, different random reviews. And today, I thought I would come down to show you something different. And the reason for that is because I love history. And throughout all of RAF Farnaby, you know, where it had the big A and everything, it's hard to find the old relics now. Um, you know, like the old runways and stuff. And I heard about this one runway, which was really, really difficult to find. And it took me to come all the way down to the uh, motorway, which is just here. And uh, I found it, guys. So here we are. We're walking on history right now. I cannot believe it. I found it. But check it out, guys. I am actually standing on the last remaining part of Area Farnaby on the runway. Now this is the old part of the runway, you can actually see some really old part of the runway here. And I tell you what guys, the history of it, it just feels so good to actually stand on a piece of history right now. I mean, wow. I never thought this was here. I really didn't guys, and it hasn't been damaged. It hasn't been vandalised. And uh, I'm going to give a shout out to Alan Taylor which is my uncle, uh, Tails World. Uh, so if you're watching this video, Alan, you've got to come down here. And we've got to arrange coming down here sometime. Cy Collins, also a really good friend of mine. I'll bring you down here sometime. My sister Jo, because she loves uh, the history videos as well. And uh, I'm actually standing on 1940s, 1930s history right now at RAF Farnaby. Right where the motorway is, you'll see the sign there, welcome to Thornaby, and some farms over there. <laughs> it's actually pouring down right now, so I'm trying to make the best of this video that I can even though it's raining, but I've got a cover over my phone, so it should be fine. Uh, but yeah, guys, this is absolutely brilliant to see, and it's not damaged or now. Still, still in its original form. The last part of the runway I am so over the moon happy and as you can see it's getting pretty wild now guys so I'm going to cut the video short thank you all so much for watching and I will see you when I take you over the parameter track in a bit when I walk over there guys so stay tuned keep yourself safe and remember look after each other We're still in the pandemic but I just had to come out and see this And I also want to say a big thank you to all of our veterans who are watching this video. If you are watching it, thank you very much. You did well for our country. For all the people that fought and served for us in the war. Thank you so much. From the bottom of my heart and everybody else's. You know, this is so great to see. And uh, you did a lot for our country, so thank you very much for that. And you're very much respected. By myself, Taylor's World and everybody else watching this video so if you like it please give it a thumbs up tell your friend about my channel it's all grown because of you guys and i'll carry this on in the next video guys so thank you very much for watching bye guys Hi right, guys how are you all doing njt reviews bringing the best in model kit reviews and also random reviews as well and today guys i bring you to the pillbox again just to see what state it's in and yeah guys the reason for doing this is just i don't know i was bored and i wanted something to do and getting out you know out and about having a little walk around seeing all the old history you know it just uh makes me happy but i've got to say this doesn't make me happy i know they've been at it again but with the graffiti it looks like they've burnt it and to be honest with you guys, uh, yeah, look at what they've done. You know, this is what our youths are of today. This is what these yobos are like. And this is what they do. So basically, they just torch it all. And then they just make a mess of everything, including our history. I mean, they've burnt all this out, guys. I mean... You know, if I was to 
you know maybe put my light on and then just show you what it's like on the inside if I can and you know they've definitely been in here and uh, I don't know guys you know could be anything in there and I don't really want to go inside of it but you know they've been at it again and it's just a shame that I have to show you all this because you know it's something that I don't really like doing because of uh, I don't know I just for a while what the war heroes have gone through and what they did for us back in the day guys you know they fought for us you know to keep us all alive you know they risked it all you know to get this in return you know I get people on my uh, on my groups on the so, given the Farnaby uh, group a shout out just because uh, it was, it's called uh, Thornaby Alerts. Just to give you guys a shout out. I know you are all admin. And I know that you're all part of it. But, you know, from what I said the other day about the parameter track. When they went out and they ruined it all. And fair enough, I know that that might be the equation. That more bikes come down there. It might be wear and tear and stuff. But it's still part of our history. You know, just like this is a part of our history. You know, and there's just no need for all this vandalism and you know all this as well what's all this about you know and the likes of telling me to go out there and get a life well maybe these yobbles need to go out and get themselves life instead of doing crap like this you know destroying our personal history you know but they don't care so but then again I do and I want to personally thank all the war heroes that served and fought for us so we could have our lives, you know. I want to thank each and every one of you guys. It's just sad that I have to bring you videos like this, you know. But then again, we live in this society now where this is the kind of stuff what happens. But anyway, this is the pillbox. It's still great to see it, though. I'm going to give a little bit of positive feedback. I don't know the day it was made here like the day it was built here i believe it was maybe 30 something like that i don't know the type so don't ask me about the type of it or whatnot but uh it's definitely old and it's definitely been here a long 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 time and there's another one that i'm going to show you deep in the woods now to show what state that's in and then we'll take it to the parameter track afterwards guys but uh anyway Thank you for watching this video. Um, on another personal note, I know that I did like doing these videos due to my anxiety and everything else. Um, and you know, anxiety and depression is, it's not a thing that's nice to live with. And these walks that I do really, really help with my depression, they help with my anxiety and all that. If it's something that you're interested in, hit me up. Uh, Mike Taylor on Facebook. Uh, you can also hit me up on Instagram. I'll put the links in the description below. And maybe we can sort something out. And, uh, you know, we can go on the walks together. Wherever it takes us. Because it really is good to get out and see nice historical facts like this. It's also nice to get out to get some fresh air. And you're not staying in the house all the time, you know. But anyway, guys, thanks very much for the, watching this video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up. There's plenty more to come. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Won't be long now. Bye. Right, guys, how are y'all doing? MJT Reviews here, bringing you the best in model kit reviews and also random reviews as well, like this one. I'm uh, deep up the top of the hill in the woods and I'm bringing you the next pillbox. Now, you will realise that I've just brought you to the other one, um, which is the first one. And this one, this one is a little bit different. Um, this one still technically technically the same as the other one it's still just as damaged as the other one is and you can definitely tell that this one's been here i don't know whether this one's been here a lot longer than the other one but it's definitely been here quite a while and uh yeah you can definitely tell it's not as damaged as the other one is but um but what i mean by that is the other one looks a bit more damaged than this one this one looks a little bit more I don't know the word I'm 
looking for, but they're both technically the same. And uh, let's have a little look. Obviously, <laughs> you can definitely tell this one's been leaking, so it's probably soggy wet inside. And uh, yeah, guys, it's what it looks like on the inside. So you can definitely tell over the years it's been torched and whatnot. And that's what it looks like on the inside. Uh, yeah. God knows what they've been doing in here. I don't really want to know, to be honest. Uh, it does have another room at the back there. So we'll just squeeze through. Uh, yeah. Uh. <laughs> I'm not going to go in there either. This must be where they hang. What I mean by that is uh, the youths and the yobbos, like I was going on about. The state of what they've done on the other one is absolutely disgusting because they've burnt all the field where it is and then it looks like they've been burned in a pillbox, but it looks like they just hang out in this one, so they maybe drink and do drugs in here. God knows what, that's why... I don't really like being on, at this one, <laughs> but it's nice to see because with the location of where it is, so it must have been protecting all this area back in the day. Um, I know it was part of our uh, Farnaby, and uh, this is why I come out here to show these videos. It's really nice to see them as well, and, you know, just to get out, get my mental health sorted out and. You know, make myself a little bit better. What I'm going to do is I'm going to walk through the woods down here, do a video there, and then I'm going to maybe do the parameter track, show you that, and then I'm going to go home and I've got a special video for you. Um, it's a model kit video. I haven't done one for a while, so stay tuned for that, guys. It's going to be awesome. But uh, as a special video, I'd like to say thank you to all of our veterans, all the people that fought and served for us in the war. You guys will never be forgotten, you know, especially in my books. I know Taylor as well, Alan Taylor, my uncle, will be the same. You know, this one's for you guys. I just hate to show you because of the state of what they're in at the moment and because of all the obos and everything. It's just horrible, guys. It really, really is, but it's amazing that they're still here to this day. And what great find was when I found... The, uh, the last remaining uh, part of the runway, which was near Anson Farm. That was brilliant. So, if you all like this video, please give it a thumbs up. So, this is the pillbox, and I'm going to go through the next part of the woods. So, I'm going to trail out of here, guys, where I came in. And this is uh, another part of Bazzy Woods that I'm going through now, guys. And I think it's absolutely amazing down here. I really, really do. There's another part going in that way. But then if you come out of here, you've got a nice scenery, you know. And it's really, really nice to just walk through these parts. And it's really, really nice as well. So, if you, you know, guys, if you're ever out and about, you want to go for a walk or something, you know, just hit me up. Uh, Mike Taylor on Facebook or uh, my Instagram, I'll link you up on that. And you can get sites like this, guys. I mean, who wouldn't want that? You know, a nice summer's day coming out and about just seeing it for what it is brilliant guys absolutely brilliant anyway i'm going to stop the video here so thanks very much for watching please give it a thumbs up if you liked the, the video tell your friends and family about my channel it's all going because of you guys and i will see you all in the next video coming up soon bye for now guys all right guys how are you all doing mjt reviews bringing the best in Model kit reviews and also the random reviews. I'm here at Bazzy Woods, and this is where I come to get my uh, daily walk and come to just take a load off. You know, honestly, guys, it's brilliant. You could take a load off your mind when you're feeling bad, you know, when you're feeling stressed or you've got anxiety or depression. You can just come down here and it's brilliant, especially in the daytime and if it's so quiet and you can just hear the birds chirping and. It's lovely. It's a little bit dull and dismal now because we're getting bad weather lately. But uh, we get scenery like this. And uh, I'm going to take you through the woods now. And then I'll take you to the parameter track and then that'll be it. And then I'm going home to do the other kit review, uh, which I've got a very special model to show you. 
But just look at the scenery, guys. Absolutely brilliant. I love coming down here. I really do. As you know, the last video I've just been up there. So there's the pillbox, as you can see. The other one's deeper, further down. Uh, near where the shell garage is. There we go. We've got a notice up there. Which tells you about a sewage station or something. I believe there was a bridge here because if you look... I know this is just me going on about my history stuff. I love going on about my history and that. If you see where the location is here... If you look over there, you can see where the bridge was. Now, I don't know the reason why they took it down, but it's nice to see that there still. So there's a lot, there's a lot of history, like, a lot of history, guys. And obviously, I'm keeping it up as possible so you can see what it's like in Bazzy Woods. There we go. Absolutely brilliant. I love the scenery around here. It's brilliant. You know, so nice. Sorry if I'm a bit slippy. My shoes are just crazy, especially coming out in horrible weather like this. <laughs> but uh, I haven't got myself any hiking boots yet. So as a reminder, Mike, get yourself some hiking boots. <laughs> so, yep. Looks like they've been having fun burning the tree down. More things to burn, I guess. Come down here and have parties, don't they? Come down here and, you know, just do whatever. <sighs> but I guess that's it. I guess that's what they do. But... It's nice and green down here though. <laughs> Look at all the greenery. <laughs> well, as you can see, I've got to watch where I'm stepping because it is very, very mucky down here. And it looks like I'm going to have to wash and clean my shoes when I get back home. Very, very mucky and filthy and horrible, but... I guess that's what you get for when you're walking down the woods, especially in rainy, hot, horrible, uh, rainy, wet conditions. And he said, don't know why I said hot there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'll be glad when I get out of it and then I can go home and get things sorted out when I get home. I didn't really have much sleep last night, guys, to be honest with you. I don't know. I guess I had a lot on my mind, really. And also, you can, you, 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 I don't know if you've ever experienced that, guys, but you know when you can't sleep on the night time, you, you, your house always makes those weird noises or weird sounds, and you're like, what was that? You know what I mean? And then, you know, I had the cats meowing outside, and then the seagulls started, and I thought, right, that's it, I'm up. You know, it's crazy. <laughs> but hopefully... I got my sleep tonight. Went to the doctor's, got me, uh, went to go and get me tablets. I get them on the Thursday. So hopefully everything's all good, guys. All good, can't complain. So I'm coming to the end of it now. Coming to the end, uh, and I'm going to be showing you the parameter track. So I'm going to wait till the calm's down a little bit because it's teaming it down, which means it's raining. But this is the woods anyway, this is where I've come. So you can see it for all yourselves, guys. Bazzy Woods. So I'll see you in the next one, guys, on the parameter track, and then that'll be the end of the video. So thanks for watching. Yeah, guys, how are you all doing MJT reviews? Uh, I'm here bringing you the parameter track, which is the last remaining part of our rare fauna bee, which is the only remaining part that's still here to this day. Uh, there's the other one way near Anson Farm, which I've been, but it's not as big as this one. This one's probably the biggest. It extends all the way because it 
from there it used to be all the way around there and then all the way down here as you can see and then uh, all the way down here guys so uh, it is a little bit worse for wear I don't know who's been damaging it um, well I do know it's like I said on the uh, the Farnaby post and I, I got a load of stick from it and they told me I need to get out more and I need to stop whinging about it and moaning about it and stuff it's just no respect guys I feel as if it's just a kick in the teeth really and they're just telling me to just get stuffed and they don't really care you know but I see shit like this and I'm sorry for saying that I see crap like this and you know it's part of our war and I don't care what anybody says it's a part of our war you know it's a part of our history as well and you know and it's just a big kick in the teeth that's how I feel it's like well we don't care we'll just destroy it you know I mean, I know it's been here for years, guys. I know it's been here for a long, long time. But there's still no need for the damage, you know. There's still no need for it. You know. And all this is done by yobbles on the quad bikes and motorbikes. And they're just tearing it all up. I mean, just look at all this, guys. I mean, look. They just don't care. It's absolutely ruined, you know. And I just don't care. I just, I just don't know, guys. I really don't. But it's still nice to see it. It's still here. All these years. It used to be a park on here, believe it or not, guys. I remember back years ago when I went to my old school. Uh, I used to go to Westlands in Farnaby. And um, we I used to come down here and there was a park here. And believe it or not, I'll just take you over. You can see where it was. You can still see where the park was uh, see over here guys where these four little columns are here if you look over here there's some there which I believe might be in a slide or swings there's this part here which I believe was a spinny top thing because you can still see where that was uh, so yeah, you can definitely see quite a lot on the here, guys. You can see where they've ripped it up, and if you look closely, wow! Look at this. Now this is old runway. This is where it's been tarmacked, but this is the old part here. So we're unearthing some old part of the runway here. You can see it. <laughs> Fantastic to see, guys. Fantastic to see. But anyway, guys, that was part of the RAF, my little uh, vlog of RAF Farnaby, taking you along the history of it all, showing you everything. I hope you like the video, guys, as much as I do, giving you these videos. I know they're not the best, I don't really want to think I'm the best, but anyway, guys, hope you like the video. Tell your friends and family about my channel, it's all good because of you guys. And right now I'm heading off back home, so thank you all so much for watching. And I will see you all in the next video that I've got coming up as soon as I get home. Uh, I think you're all going to enjoy it. I say I haven't done a model kit video for a while. So thanks so much for watching guys. Much respect to you all. Much respect to the veterans and all the people who served and died for us in the war. This one goes out to all you guys. Really, really means a lot. And I'm going to give a shout out to Alan Taylor, Taylor's World. Thanks for the last couple of days, it's been brilliant playing Ogs of War and everything, so I owe you a thanks on that. And thanks very much, guys. We're all fond of See you later, guys.